Hello Procrastinator, Sam here, and today we're going to be reacting to the deleted and extended scenes in Sonic Movie 2, which was just released digitally. So if you guys haven't watched my first video going over the new animated short that they released in this digital release, make sure you guys watch that video first. I really love that animation. Now, we're going to be reacting to these extended scenes, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what they may have took out of this movie because I really, really love this movie. I will say there was some parts of the movie, if you guys watched my review, that I thought may, went, may have went on too long, specifically the wedding scene. I didn't hate th that the wedding scene was in the movie. I just hated how much of it was in the movie. But in the end of the day, it didn't take away my overall excitement of the movie. I still think this movie is absolutely fantastic, and you guys should absolutely support this movie. But I'm really interested in seeing what they may have cut out of this movie because the movie for a lot of people already seemed too long so uh, from what i see in the playlist here there is 17 minutes of content to watch so i'm surprised there's this much that they already took out and the movie still ended up being really long so if you guys go on to enjoy my reaction go and hit that like button and go and hit the subscribe button and hit the bell so you guys stay up to date with my video with all that said let's jump right into the reaction <laughs> Okay, first video is Mushroom Planet intro, so let's go. The Mushroom Planet. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, it's uh, Sorry guys, it looks like this is actually in the Mario movie. <laughs> it's so funny because... Uh, okay, so this is all just uh, uh, 2D animated, obviously for the... Uh, um, for the uh, 3D artist to look at as a reference. I will say though, this is probably gonna be a muted segment here because I know there is music to Sonic Movie 2 and it is playing one of them right now. And you know, uh, for, for uh, you know, not getting copyrighted, I am gonna try not to play as much of the music as possible, but okay. So. 243 in this portable of purgatory. Oh boy. <laughs> My only companion is a rock okay. guy named Stone. So, so far everything seems to be normal. Just for whom am I narrating this? <laughs> okay. I'm surprised the electricity was already animated. <laughs> it's like something crawled into the filter and died. <laughs> well, that's new. What are you smirking at? Oh my god. <laughs> Careful, Stone. You're getting soft. Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> you put in the coffee? What? Something to relax you, doctor. He's oh, high on I shrooms? Joy, joy, joy. Oh yeah. my god! Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Enjoy it. <laughs> this looks like a Snapchat filter, but it's so funny. What? Oh my god. Okay, I see why they took this out. Why is that spec road larger? <laughs> because that's an asteroid descending at an incredible rate of- no! Oh my god! <laughs> see? Wait, what? You gonna spell something? What is happening? Wait! I think he's trying to tell us something! Oh my god, he is tripping so bad. This is so funny. I'm so surprised they took this out. Well, I see why. Bacon. I'd like to buy a vowel, Pat. Oh my god. Oh, beacon. Oh, that's where we get the idea to do a beacon. Beacon. But that's a bit too random. Beacon. I completely. An intergalactic beacon with optical frequency multiplier amplified by intensity radiated floods. Okay. I see why they cut this out. <laughs> Coming right up, Doctor. <laughs> Is that that's actually Liam Stoob in a rock suit? Incredible. Okay. My calculations are correct, and there's no reason to say it because they always are. This quill is going to power my master. This is so funny. I cannot believe he was he was tripping like balls. That was so funny. Oh my god, he didn't even get to finish the sentence. Okay, that's funny. Alrighty, so he sends out the wake, so that's all the same. Is there gonna be a difference in uh people that come? Or is that is that the uh 
where this ends. That's where this ends. Okay. Wow. That was absolutely hilarious. I did not expect them to go that far with the shrooms. And for some reason, it never occurred to me. Oh yeah. He's been living off of shrooms. Some of them might do a little something to his brain. So that's actually really funny. And part of me wishes some of that was still in the movie. I wish the rock was still like he was talking to the rock and he was hallucinating that way. But I guess because, you know, sometimes they like to target these movie towards kids. They probably don't want, you know, tripping on shroom jokes in the movie. But I still think it was kind of funny. But the idea of him doing a beacon from being on shrooms, I, I feel like that's strange because he's an evil genius. He would have already known how to do that. So I see why they cut it. Uh, don't get me wrong. But wow, that was an incredibly funny scene. That was, that was, that had way more than I thought it was. So we're going to jump to the next one. This one is called Sonic Caught Sneaking Out. So here we go. Alrighty, here we go. Oh, wow. The wedding invitation. Hey, buddy. Get some good sleep last night? Huh? Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, uh, uh... <laughs> okay, so he already knows he snuck out, I think. Yo, pancakes. Oh my god, those look so good. Oh no, he's already too tired. Okay. So this is before he went. Um, that's Jeff Fowler. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's funny. That's funny. That's funny. They should have yeah. kept that in. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, so this is all the same. And then it's that animatronic. Okay, so that's all. That's all the same. That's really funny. I wish they kind of kept that part moment with the mo with the with the with the news on. That was really funny. Okay. Yeah, so this is all the same. A little more extended, but all the same. Oh no, the ball didn't fall. Oh, now it fell. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. That's funny. A rose? Okay, you know what? This is more charming. This is more of what I think Sonic well, would do. Uh, oh. Uh, you know what? Okay. Um, Where did he steal them? Sonic, <laughs> we need to talk to you. And you know what? I think you two deserve some romantic alone time. That's really funny. <laughs> Sonic, I think we need to talk. Shh, Tom. Don't speak. <laughs> Dude, I love I love this scene. I actually love this scene. This should have stayed. At least some of this should have stayed. Okay. So we're gonna do this every time he sneaks out. Man. I mean he really classed up the place, but still. I love the scene. Let me know your thoughts in the uh in the comments. I like this. Actually, I think I know a way to get through. Oh my, that's his dad. <laughs> okay. So, all right. So then it would cut to the boat scene. Okay. So my thoughts on this one is I, I, okay. I see why they cut it because obviously with the official, with the final movie, they cut right to the chase. They kind of had, uh, you know, uh, Sonic, you know, he didn't try to butter him up after that. Um, but I do like how Sonic tried to butter them up here. I don't know why. I just found it really funny. And him immediately jumping awake from the news. I feel like that. At least that should have stayed. At least that part should have stayed. That part was really funny. Um, but yeah, I see why they cut it. They wanted to cut to the chase uh, faster. Um, but I, I really like that scene. It was really funny. So, all right, let's jump to the next one. The next one is called Getting Ready for Hawaii. Okay, so for this scene, I did watch this one already. I actually released this on Twitter for people to watch. Um, but I will say, so this, this scene is really charming. I do like it. But I do see why they cut yeah, it. Again, they want to mitigate Sonic. the amount of no Sonic, I think, as much as possible. Because already we have that huge wedding scene in the movie that takes up a lot of the time. So I see why they cut this one. But I do like this part here. The fact that he goes over the fact that he's making Wade the, the, the sheriff for the weekend. I'm happy that they emphasize it here. 
I do like that. Blue devil's ready for this kind of but I don't think this part was necessary because with the other deleted scene and with what's already in the movie, I don't think they need to hone in the fact that he's sneaking out so much, you know? Go and trust him at some point. But yeah, uh, uh, this scene here, I think it, this is more of the mother, a father figure type thing with Sonic. Um, but uh, yeah, I see why they cut it. I do. Man to man bow talk. It's a pretty big deal. You're a dork. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Again, but I do like I do like uh, uh, Tom and Rachel's dynamic. I do. Out of all the humans, they're definitely my favorite. Uh, well, actually, Robotnik is my favorite, and then Limush do. But I do like their demand, their dynamic, and again, uh, the whole ugly shirt thing. So I this scene uh, I think was totally fine to cut. Uh, nothing of real value was lost. I do like him talking about how he was going to make Wade the share for the weekend. They probably could have kept that snip it in somewhere but um i am i am you know i'm not i'm not too upset that that one was cut so the next one is tails meets wade so this is going to be uh interesting so let's jump into this one another one i have not seen yet so here we go oh yeah wade it's just fixing a bike car, we got this super cool bike you've had since I ow <laughs> Uh, okay. This does not seem familiar with basic mechanical operation. Oh, mm -hmm. Wade, don't underestimate him. Oh boy. <laughs> don't overestimate him either. That's funny. Try not to cry. Pick it up and start. Mm -hmm. Again. Yeah, I'm not sure why he would have to sneak into it. Oh, he's hey, not. They're not. You right over there? Hey, yeah, oh, this this right this animation was done. Fixing up the old Never mind. No, it's not. <laughs> yeah, I thought maybe I'd get back in shape, shed a few lbs, you know. Plus, someone did steal a police car. Oh, that's oh, why. He's not from around here. Tails. Okay, I see why they're doing this because Tails is another alien guy, so. Super secure. <laughs> no one comes in or out. Well, except for my mom. But worst she'll do is make us a pretty cool snack plate. All right. You guys like <laughs> ants on a log? Ew, oh, the snack plate. That's ants. why. Raisins that you sprinkle on peanut butter that's laid on a bed of celery. You guys never what? had that snack before? What? Oh, it still sounds disgusting. Why? What? Okay. I see why they cut it out. I see why they cut it out. I I was confused in the final movie because Robotnik says to uh, to to wade you smell like a snack plate he goes yeah i had a few today i thought that interaction was very very random um but i do like sonic introducing wade to tails this way because tails is not from earth he looks just like the, he's like sonic he's like an alien so i see why sonic would be hesitant to introduce him to another human so i wish they i wish they kept that part in the whole Ants on a log thing, which I will say is a great snack. I used to have them all the time and I still do. I'm not going to lie. But uh, that part, he could have done it without. But him introducing Tails like that, I think that's totally fine. They could have cut to where we started in the movie in the garage. But yeah, uh, I, I see why they cut this out. Um, but yeah, a little uh, another interesting scene here. And the next scene we have is Robotnik's fake crowdfund scheme. So this one was the first one that was released on Twitter. And I totally know why they cut this one, but this one was so funny and I can't wait to watch this again. So here we go right now. Okay, so it all starts with them transforming the mean shop, the mean bean shop into his lair, which is funny as always. From the Robotnik Manifesto, Section 5, Article 12. In the event of my captain's disappearance <laughs> or account suspension on social media, Construct a secure safe house built to my exact specifications. That's funny. Yeah. That's really, that's really, I really like that part and I really wish they kept that in. Because goodness thrives when bad men do nothing. I really like, again, I really like Robotnik and Agent Stone's dynamic. And again, I do love. My exact specifications include sprinkling my beautiful equipment with your decomposing epidermis particles. Huh? <laughs> what is he even saying? But again, I can hardly breathe in here. It's as though I was struck with new and ultra microscopic silico volcano coniosis. Huh? 
<laughs> I'm sorry, it's difficult to Google with one hand. Uh. It's a lung disease <laughs> caused by the inhalation of ash. What? Ooh, oh, hey! <laughs> something but yeah, this is really funny, though. I, uh... So this part is where I started to see it. Um, but I do like them explaining why it was a mean bean shop, why it was a coffee shop. Oh, yeah, the, the whole government part. <laughs> I don't get why he's doing the robot sounds. It's so funny. They want to make me disappear like they did Taylor Lothner and the ShamWow guy. <laughs> Since I've been gone, humanity seems to have slipped into some sort of uh, cancel culture. Not Any wrong. Event, <laughs> it's getting harder to be diabolical. I wish that part was stable in the movie. <laughs> Cute. Very, very, very nice. <laughs> this part is... I see why they cut this out. <laughs> Obviously, this is pure evil for Robotnik, but this is an actual problem with crowd funds, so... Oh, man. Oh, my God. I miss this guy. I love the guy holding knuckles. It's so funny. I never met mine. <laughs> Again, that interaction. I wish they kept that in. Okay, so yes, uh, multiple thoughts on this movie. I on this scene here. I love how in this scene they explain why Lemush Dube's character Agent Stone was working as a bartista in a coffee shop. I like that explanation, and I like them having that explanation in the movie i also like just agent stone and and robotics um um you know th their symmetry there the chemistry and i love them engaging with each other it's a it's really funny um especially when robotnik you know you know tricks him and smashes his foot that part's funny um i i do see why they cut this out though the the whole uh uh crowdfunding thing i think again they probably don't want to go too far with that that is a real problem with with crowd funds you never know whether they're legit or not but um it, it's really funny uh that they did that joke here um but i see why they cut it out but again it's an evil thing for someone to do and guess what robotnik is evil so i get why they were doing it but again i wish some parts again that seems to be the main theme with almost all deleted scenes so far which i wish some parts still stay in the movie but the whole reason why they cut it i understand so with that said, let's go to the second to last one here called Knuckles Learns the Meaning of Lying. Very interesting. Let's see what this one is all about here. How's it going? Just, all right, so this is <laughs> the dot, dot, dot scene of the movie. One of my favorite parts of the movie. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, boy. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Are these Idris Elba's, like, first dot, takes? Is that what I'm hearing? Dot, it's just a different person. Dot, dot. Mm-hmm. Because that simple word okay. space trash is the key to something extraordinary. Something to help you get revenge on the hedgehog. Think bigger stone. The emerald he seeks could be. So this is all normal so far. My genius wouldn't just be recognized on Earth. It's spread far. I think this is a different take though, right? Allowing me to harness all No, this seems like the same universe. take, maybe? Commune with darkness itself. Wow. <laughs> that sounds big been on my vision board for years it's a law of attraction didn't you see the secret <laughs> okay so everything is normal so far another boring night at home the hedgehog has returned home Falsehood, okay which is latin for wrongo <laughs> according to my worldwide <laughs> network cell tower triangulation he's lying all the way in siberia the okay of eastern siberia Right. He's a long distance liar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's more where that came from. Mm, Smash it. Okay. Lying? Huh? Explain this to me. Oh, this is different. It means not telling the truth, primarily as a way of deceiving someone. Dishonor. Huh. Lying can be extremely advantageous. Watch <laughs> this. <laughs> oh, stone. <clears throat> yes, doctor. Have I told you how invaluable you are to me? Thank you, Maestro. I'll never stop. <laughs> Listen up. 
Oh God. <laughs> a new friend here to retrieve his emerald. But I need you to stay put and guard the mean being. Okay. The steadfast. I see why they cut this. Look it up later. This is I see why they cut this. Stuff. It's all right on this. Can you handle it? <laughs> yes, sir. You can count on me. Okay. I'm yeah. I'm ready for anything. I see. Ah! What? He just threw pizza. <laughs> All right. I do not understand. Guarding this place is of no relevance to our mission. I know. I lied. There's no room on the ship for stow. Unless you want them in your lap. Dishonor. This is how, is I, how I roll. Okay. <laughs> All right. I totally see why they cut that. That was probably one of the most unnecessary scenes, I think. The whole lying thing. Uh, I feel like that part was just too elementary uh so i see why they cut that out I, I liked what they did in the in the final movie where he just smashes the holograms like magic hedgehog destroyed i think that part was way funnier uh and definitely delivered way better on that so uh, i totally get why they cut that out um I, I i i love again i love the dynamic between robotnik and stone but that one i totally see why they cut that out so no complaints by me for cutting that one out Alrighty guys, our final scene here is Wade discovers Robotnik's secret hideout. I'm wondering if we're gonna be able to see what, okay, so before jumping in, my immediate thing that I really wanna see more of is the classic Robotnik suit. I wonder if they're gonna dive into that or if there's any other suit variations that were in this scene here. So let's see. Alrighty, here we go. <laughs> so, okay, so hey, he's on his little Razor scooter. How you doing? Can't hear you, I'm moving too fast. <laughs> So again, I I didn't put two and two together, but the reason why he's on the scooter is because again his car was stolen, so it makes sense. I don't know about anyone else. I I love Wade's character. Also, he just totally went through a crosswalk. That's really funny. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay, they're really dragging out the scene here. Okay, here we go. Is there any other ones? Was that one on the right new? Oh, Sorry, okay. Sonic. I guess I'm gonna have to ruin Tom's vacation. Thank you, I'm clear. Get me Tom, ASAP stat. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so I like this part. So I always wondered how a gun knew. This is Commander Walters. He's got a call from local law enforcement in Green Hills, Montana. Says it's urgent. I put him. Put him through. Wait, is <laughs> that you? Tom, thank God. Robotnik is back. Yep, we knew that already. Wait. Oh, okay, there we go. Know that he's got an evil lair set up inside the mean bean. What? Okay. Okay. Wade. Listen to me very carefully. So that's new. Don't move. You understand? I'm going to get there as fast as I can. Go in. Do you want me to go in there? No, wait. Do not go <laughs> in there. Understand? Okay, he's going to go in there. You got it, big dog. I heard you loud and clear. <laughs> sure for the weekend. Go in here. Okay, so now I see. You believe us now? Okay, so that I wish was still in the movie. That was, I feel like that was essential to how we knew why, how Gunn knew this he was in there. Walters. Scramble every piece of hardware to Green Hills, Montana. We have a code mustache. I repeat, code, code mustache. mustache. Bring that chopper in. Well, that was quick. Okay. So I see, okay. That one. Okay. So obviously there's a lot of extra scene in there where he's like, outside the shop, like looking around for like an extra 30 seconds. I get why that was cut, but I liked the scene of, of, of Wade calling it in. So that way gun then knew, you know, to go to the mean being. So I do like that again, uh, the parts I like in these latest scenes is the parts that would just make the narrative stronger. Just, just so there's no questions as to how this happened, why this happened, just a stronger narrative altogether. But, um, 
I do see why, you know, it was caught ultimately again to save on time. The movie was probably way too long. But again, at the end of the day, I would have taken some of these scenes over some of the stuff that happened in the wedding. Personally, for me, uh, I do think a lot of the whole Rachel and Randall stuff, uh, especially regarding the whole um, uh, Rachel and Maddie's character trying to save Sonic and Tails, I think that segment could have been cut down by like five minutes. Um, and I feel like I would have taken more of these deleted scenes. Because again, these were really charming and, and really good, honestly. No complaints by me there. And alrighty guys, that is it for the deleted and extended scenes. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Again, uh, my overall thoughts with these is that these were really awesome to see, first off. Again, I loved this movie. Please go out and watch the movie. Again, you guys should have at this point. Please go watch this movie and support it. And uh, I, I really did like seeing these. Um, again, I do understand why um, most of these were deleted, uh, but I feel like there is something, some little snippet in each part of these scenes that probably would have helped the movie be even stronger narratively. Um, and I think there's some parts in the final movie, especially specifically the wedding scene, that could have been cut out to make room for said deleted uh, segments here. But I, I think the majority of the deleted scenes here is just to prioritize Sonic Tails and Knuckles, and I'm not against that. I think they want to mitigate the time humans have on camera, so that way Sonic Tails and Knuckles are the stars of the show, and they absolutely were in Sonic Movie 2. So with all that said, thank you guys so much for watching my reaction to these. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure if you guys enjoyed, you hit the like button, you hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell so you guys know when I upload. With all that said, this is Sam signing out. See you later, procrastinators.